Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the latest episode on the Scan Tool Network. In this video, I'm going to be looking at the best diagnostic scan tools and scanners for Porsche vehicles in 2021 and 2022. And at the end of this video, I'll tell you which of these tools I would personally choose given my 15 years experience in the field. Now I'm going to put links to all of these kits in the description below this video and in the pinned comment section. So be sure to follow those links only because they will take you to genuine and official products because fakes and clones do exist, so be very careful. Now, I'm going to be starting with the cheapest tool, working my way along to the most expensive. And what you'll generally find is the more expensive a tool or the more you pay for a tool, you'll get more functionality out of that tool. But that's not to say that the cheapest tool on this table will not do a job just as well for you. So we're going to be starting with the POR version 1.0. That's P-O-R for Porsche version 1.0 kit. Now this tool will work on cars from I would say the 986 to the 996 era onwards through to the 991 and will eventually work on the 992 era. Uh, it currently works on the 718s and all of the new Cayennes, Panameras, etc. So this tool will allow you to, let's say for example, you've got an airbag light or a check engine light or an airbag, uh, sorry, an ABS or PSM light. Um, transmission, this tool will allow you to diagnose and reset those fault codes and indeed reset the warning light as well. This will also allow you to do the service reset. So if you've got a service required or overdue message, then this will allow you to do the reset on that as well. That is the version 1.0 tool. That is the cheapest tool. That's what we definitely recommend if you're wanting a tool just for Porsche. Uh, we then come on to the version 2.0 kit. This kit does everything that this kit will do, but this has more service functions. So the service functions can include things like electronic parking brake, DPF, regeneration for suitable vehicles. Um, what else does this do? It also does injector coding, ABS brake bleeding, electronic throttle reset, steering angle sensor, new battery registration and reset. But it all really depends on the vehicle. You know, all those functions I've just mentioned don't necessarily work on all cars. So it's very worth checking with Diagnostic World. I'll put the link in the description below this video or the email address below so you can contact those guys to make sure those functions are suitable for your vehicle. You know, it does cover things like DPF on the Cayennes and the Panameras, but obviously it's not going to do DPF on things like the 997 or the 986 because they just don't have those systems installed into the vehicle. So do a quick check before you go out and buy. Um, we then come on to the iCarsoft EU Pro Kit. Now this kit will do everything that both of these kits will do, so you don't lose any functionality. What this does though, it covers more manufacturers as well. So let's say for example, you have a Porsche in your family. Uh, you know, it could be a weekend car, it could be a daily driver, or you have a different car for your daily or your weekend car. This tool will come into play when that situation arises. So you might have, you know, another family car, a friend, a friend's car, a relative's car. Uh, it might be a BMW, it might be an Audi, VW, Seat, Skoda, Mercedes, whatever. So long as it's European, this kit will cover the European manufacturers for all of the systems within the vehicle and the special functions as well, providing those special functions are included in the vehicle. Um, so moving on from the EU Pro, we come to a tool which looks exactly the same. This is called the CR Pro though, and this does exactly everything that all of these tools will do, but this covers worldwide manufacturers. So it does the Asian market like Toyota, Lexus, Isuzu, uh, Nissan, Subaru, Honda, Mitsubishi, Mazda, you name it. It does all of those Asian markets, but it will also cover the American markets as well. So you've got your Chrysler, your Citroen, your Jeep, uh, sorry, not Citroen, Chrysler, Chevrolet, uh, Jeep, Hummer, GMC, uh, you know, those types of manufacturers, does all the American Fords as well, and obviously all of the European things as well. So this is a really good option if you want to make sure that your tool is going to cover absolutely all manufacturers. And then we come on to the MK808 kit. This is the best tool out of all of these. It's the most expensive as well. So the reason it's more expensive is probably because of the additional manufacturer coverage so you will get a lot of Chinese cars and a few extra extra additional uh, European and American, American manufacturers but really the value in this tool is the service option because you get 25 
additional service options over and above all of these. So you'll get things like gear learning, uh, adaptions, you'll get suspension calibrations. Uh, so there's a real good reason why this tool does cost a lot more. It is better, but I understand that it's probably going to be out of the reach or price range for most DIYers. So um, I would say it's probably more geared towards people who have an unlimited budget and want to just dive in and get the best tool, absolutely fine. Or maybe if you work in sort of a, a garage workshop, small garage workshop, mobile mechanic environment, where you just don't know what kind of car you're going to be dealing with on a day to day basis, that's when I think you'd probably go for this tool. But like I guess it all really depends on your specific needs your specific requirements. If you only have uh, something like a 986 or a, a 987 or a 996 or 997 and you just want to do a, an airbag reset or an ABS PSM diagnose reset, then there's no problem with going for the POR version 1.0. It'll do the reset just as well as the re this tool will do the reset as well. Um, so that's something for you to consider. Which of these tools though would I personally go out and buy if it was my money and I was to recommend something for you guys? It would be this one here, the CR Pro Kit, because you get all of the functionality, all of the system coverage, but you also get all of the manufacturer coverage and you get the special functions as well. Um, all of that, I believe, for the best value for money tool, if you like. There's a big jump for the price of this to this tool and you get extra services, but for the value for money factor, I think you definitely got to be looking at this tool here. This is the CR Pro Kit. Uh, but as I say, links to all of these kits are in the description and the pinned comments. And make sure you're following those links to get genuine official products. If you do have any questions about any of these tools, I'll put the email address in the description below this video. So you can contact Diagnostic World and they will give you a quick answer as to whether these tools are going to be suitable for your needs or not. Uh, ultimately, it's all down to you and your budget and what you're looking to get out of a tool. I hope you've watched, I hope you've enjoyed this video and if you have then please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time on the Scan Tool Network.